top Indian women scientists. Gender equality has been one of the most debated topics in the past decade. Though most of us agree that women deserve equal rights and opportunities as men, yet there are many challenges that a woman has to face regularly. Technology has advanced so much over the years and this wouldn't have been possible without the contribution of people in science. While we know about the priceless contribution of great scientists like C. V. Raman, Meghnath Saha, Dr. A. P. J. Abdul Kalam, many of us are unaware about the contributions of women in the field of science. Here is a brief profile of famous Indian women scientists. Beginning with the first lady scientist of India, we present Asima Chatterjee. Asima Chatterjee's contribution to organic chemistry was huge. She is known for the development of anti-elliptical drug Ayush 56 and anti-malarial drugs along with her research on Vinca alkaloids. She became the first woman to be conferred a doctorate of science by an Indian university based on her research on the chemistry of plant products and synthetic organic chemistry. At number 2, we have Dr. Indira Hinduja. Dr. Indira is one of the renowned gynecologist, obstetrician and infertility specialist who introduced GIFT, gamete intrafallopian transfer. Her research work in GIFT has been published in many prestigious national and international journals. She delivered India's first test tube baby. At number 3, we have Shubha Tole, Indian neuroscientist, professor and principal investigator at the Tata Institute of Fundamental Research in Mumbai, India. She discovered a master regulator gene which controls the development of brains, cortis, hippocampus and amygdala. She was a recipient of Shanti Suru Bhadnagar Prize in 2010. At number 4, we have Darshan Ranganathan. Well known for her work in bioorganic chemistry, she is noted for her work in supramolecular assemblies, molecular design, chemical simulation of key biological processes, synthesis of functional hybrid peptides and synthesis of nanotubes. She was the most prolific organic chemist in India. At number 5, we have Paramjeet Khurana, an Indian scientist in plant biotechnology, molecular biology, Genomics presently professor in the Department of Plant Molecular Biology in the University of Delhi, Delhi. Known for inventing all weather seeds, she developed hybrid strains of mulberry, wheat and rice that are drought resistant, can withstand heat and have a higher UV radiation capacity, thus helping farmers who depend on weather conditions for their crops. At number 6, we have the Indian oceanographer Dr. Aditi Pant. She was the first Indian woman to visit Antarctica alongside geologist Sudipta Sen Gupta in 1983 as a part of the Indian Antarctic program. She participated in the third and fifth Indian expeditions to Antarctica to research about oceanography and geology. Pant is the owner of five patents and has over 67 publications in international journals. At number 7, we have Tessie Thomas, an Indian scientist and Director General of Aeronautical Systems and the former Project Director for Agni Fourth Missile in Defense Research and Development Organization. She is the first ever woman scientist to head a missile project in India. 
She is known as the Missile Lady due to the successful launch of Agni series of missiles. She was the project director for the Agni 4th and Agni 5th missile in defense research and development organization. Standing proud at number 8, we have Ritu Karidhal, an Indian scientist working with the Indian Space Research Organization. She was a Deputy Operations Director to India's Mars Orbital Mission Mangalyaan. She has been referred to as one of the many rocket women of India. In 2007, she also received the ISRO Young Scientist Award from the then President of India, APJ Abdul Kalam. At number 9, we have Charusita Chakravarti. She was an Indian academic and scientist. She was a professor of chemistry at the Indian Institute of Technology, Delhi, since 1999, best known for her work on the basis of molecules and effects of change in molecular base on DNA proteins, she has also worked on classical and quantum Monte Carlo, molecular dynamics and structure and dynamics of liquids. Her research work earned her the Shanti Swarup Bhadnagar Prize and BM Birla Science Award. Tracing back to the British era, at number 10, we bring you the first female doctor of India, Dr. Anandibai Joshi. She was one of the first Indian female doctors of Western medicine alongside Kadambini Ganguly. She went abroad to study medicine in Women's Medical College of Pennsylvania in 1886. The princely state of Kolhapur appointed her as the physician in charge of the female ward of the local Albert Edward Hospital. Anandibai died of tuberculosis early in the next year on 26 February 1887 before turning even 22 in Pune. Too sad indeed. At number 11, we again bring you a woman scientist from the British era, Janaki Amal, an Anglo-Indian botanist who worked on plant breeding, cytogenetics a branch of genetics that is concerned with how the chromosomes can relate to the cell behavior and phytogeography. The first Indian scientist to have received the Padmashri Award in 1977, who went on to occupy the reputed post of the Director General of the Botanical Survey of India. Amal's most renowned work is on sugarcane and brinjal. At number 12, Kamala Sohani, another woman scientist dating back to the pre-independence period, she was an Indian biochemist who in 1939 became the first Indian woman to receive a PhD in a scientific discipline. She applied to the IISC for a research fellowship and met with rejection merely because she was a woman. She was the first female student of Professor C. V. Raman. She discovered that every cell of a plant tissue contained the enzyme cytochrome C, which was involved in the oxidation of all plant cells. At number 13, we have Rajeshwari Chatterjee. She was the first woman engineer from Karnataka during her tenure. At the Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore, Chatterjee was a professor and later chairperson of the Department of Electrical Communication Engineering. Her contributions to the field of microwave and antenna engineering are significant. She and her husband built a microwave research laboratory and began research in the field of microwave engineering, the first such research in India. At number 14, we have Kamal Ranadev. She was an Indian biomedical researcher known for her research on the links between cancers and viruses. She was a founding member of the Indian Women Scientists Association. In the 1960s, she established India's first tissue culture research laboratory at the Indian Cancer Research Center in Mumbai. Ranadev was awarded the Padma Bhushan, India's third highest civilian award for medicine in 1982. 
at number 15, we proudly present the unforgettable India's first lady in space, Kalpana Chawla. She was an Indian-born American astronaut and engineer who was the first woman of Indian origin to go to space. She first flew on a space shuttle Columbia in 1997 as a mission specialist and primary robotic arm operator. Her second flight was on STS-107, the final flight of the Space Shuttle Columbia in 2003. Chavla was one of the seven crew members who died in the Space Shuttle Columbia disaster when the spacecraft disintegrated during its re-entry into the Earth's atmosphere. Now let's do a quick recap. Kamal Ranadev Asima Chatterjee, Anandibai Joshi, Janaki Ammal, Darshan Ranganathan, Dr. Indira Hinduja, Dr. Aditi Pant, Paramjit Kurana, Kalpna Chavla, Tessie Thomas. Charusita Chakravarti, Rajeshwari Chatterjee, Ritu Karidhal, Kamla Sohani, all are remarkable, renowned, and hard working lady scientists of India, always making our country proud. And with that, I'm signing off. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe to this channel for more such updates. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.